Today I'm going to bleach my seashells. They are going to go from looking like this, dirty and brown, to hopefully looking like this. I already bleached this one. Cleaned it, bleached it, and it came out pretty white. So if you compare them, hopefully these, especially these big ones, will get nice and clean. So first I have to go get some bleach at Walmart. I can remember where I parked, I can go home and bleach my seashells. But I don't know where that is. But I think I see it. Oh, there we are! There we are! Yay! There's the Chihuahua Mama! Okay. I was so disoriented. I was lost in the parking lot. And I don't even know if I have to go left or right to go home, but... This says only left hand turn so I guess I have to go that way and we'll see if it's the right way or not and I still don't know if it's whoops I still don't know if it's the right way home and no definitely have to make a u-turn up here why do I not know directions I had to be out on the road to realize I was going the wrong way I need my GPS AKA Steven. Got back from Walmart and got my bleach. Um, for our first step, we have to clean all the hard dirt from the inside and outside, get all the loose dirt um, off the seashells. So I'm going to do that right now. Now it's time for the bleach. I'm going to put all the seashells in this uh, garbage can I got here. Whoops, these are still filled with dirt. Now I'm going to pour the bleach over the seashells. Normally I would, well, you're supposed to make like a water mixture, but I'd rather not do that and just pour the straight bleach. I feel like it gets it better. So I'm going to do, this is two quarts of just straight bleach. I'm only going to use some water if this two quarts doesn't cover the top of the seashells, which it doesn't look like it's going to. Well, maybe it will. Let me just fix it a little. So, I'm going to have to dilute it a little bit with water because it doesn't cover the top. seashells are covered and I'm going to let it sit for a few hours maybe overnight I think I left this one sit overnight um, and I want to get just as nice and clean as oh, look, there's dirt in there nice and clean as this one so we'll see how long it takes and that's all for now <coughs> cool. 
can. Is it right here? Are the details ready? Goopy. Goopy. You comfy? We waiting for the seashells to be ready. Are you comfy? Yes. I love you too. What do you see out there? You see people out the window? Just hanging out. It's been about... How many hours has it been, Coop? I think it's been like two hours since I soaked my seashells last, so I am going to go to... Hi, Coop! The bathroom. Jeez. Oh, to check on my uh, seashells. Let me show you what they look like. Yeah, like I said, it's only been about two or I don't know, three hours at most. <sighs> eh, it'll look brighter in the actual bleach water. Okay, so it's still got some sitting to do in there. Move that in. Make sure it's covered. Mm. Oh, I can't get it to cover again. Come on, seriously. This is the before of my black rings, and we'll show you the after. I'm gonna polish. This one, this one, and this one. This got a little black on it too. Looks like it's like polishing. All right, these are all coming good, except for this Hawaiian one I got from eBay, which I don't know why. Like this shined up perfectly fine. I know this is sterling silver. This one shined up perfectly fine too. Why this one's stamped sterling silver? Why isn't this one working? Hmm. It's not as shiny as I like it, but it's way better. I guess that's good enough. These ones came out really good. It's now the next day and my seashells are all done bleaching. Um, they came out just as white as the original one. So that's the original one here. And then these are all the seashells that I bleached. So I think they came out pretty good. Um, less than 24 hours and they're perfectly sparkly shiny white. So, all done. Bye!